So this summer, before I moved here to Barcelona, I reached out to my school asking them how can I prepare myself in the best way possible for my, for my studies this fall. They gave me several great tips and one of them was to get a sketchbook and start drawing from life. I found this to be extremely helpful and in this video of the Journaling Mondays, I'll give you three reasons to why you should invest in a sketchbook. Reason number one is that you train your eye by drawing from life. What I mean by that is, in order to learn how to draw, you first have to learn how to see properly. Um, the problem with drawing from a computer screen or an iPad is that it's a 2D surface, which is making your job of creating a 3D object on paper much more difficult. A huge component in drawing realistic is of course to make it 3D, to actually make it pop from the paper. And I found it by experience uh, from drawing in a sketchbook from life that it's so much more easier when you are actually observing an object in real life, a 3D object. So reason number two in this episode is that by drawing from life in a sketchbook, you will learn how to find your style. So when I just sit down to draw casually, I usually draw something organic, I realized. I'm very drawn to, to uh, things from nature. It could be a small leaf, it could be something from, from the sea, um, but usually very organic nature things. Um, so for me, this is a good way of realizing that that's my kind of uh, preference in design. So when you sit down to draw something, maybe maybe you you find that you're naturally drawn to to like architecture and and uh, technical stuff, and then you realize that that's your that's your preference in design. So by just looking back in your sketchbook, you will realize that okay, this is what I'm drawn to, and maybe I should focus on this because this is what I most enjoy creating. The reason number three is to learn how to convey feelings. Uh, with an image. So I think it's absolutely beautiful to look back in a journal that is filled with, uh, with drawings. However, as you can see, mine is mainly filled with text, which is something you have to work on, but I think that it could be both therapeutic and good for you to, to, um, to train your ability to convey feelings in a picture to say that something has happened to you, either good or bad, uh, to capture this feeling in an image uh, the way that you, that you want to, is a super good way to actually uh, train your ability to capture those feelings in an image, which, is, which will be invaluable when you start creating your own art. Okay, so to summarize this video, reason number one was that without uh, a sketchbook you will miss opportunities to train your eye by drawing from life. Reason number two was that without the sketchbook you will maybe never find your style or at least you will you will not know your preferences preferences in design uh, which is very helpful when you want to create something. And reason number three was that without a journal you you will um, not train your ability to uh, capture feelings in an image as well as uh, if you would have practiced it in, uh, in your sketchbook. And hey, if, if you don't have a sketchbook, why not start um, drawing in, in your journal? I mean, you can use the journal for most things, right? So uh, you can both write in it and uh, capture small images, it could be small sketches, and fill your journal and make it even more beautiful. That was all from um, me here in Barcelona. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. And uh, me and Fred will see you next Monday. Bye bye. Bye.